Welcome back to my channel. I'm Skyla, and today we are doing a custom concept showcase. Why don't we jump on in? So the first hair I want to show you is a Stelphix bun. It's really, really cute. It, I mean, I really love Stelphix, but this is one of their top-notch hairs. Like, I just, I have a lot of their hairs, if you can't tell whenever I scroll through. Like, I have a lot of their hairs. So, this hair is very realistic. It has a lot of beautiful colors, and even when you scroll back, like, zoom out, there's a lot of detail in this hair. I really love how detailed it is, so you can find all the links in the description for this hair and every other one I'm going to show you. Please check those out so you don't have to search for them, and thank you for watching this. So, next hair. So this next hair I'm going to show you is by Butterfly Sims. It's shiny, and I usually don't like shiny hairs in the Sims 4 because I just feel like with the cartoonish way they look, shiny would not be the way to go. It would be more of like realistic, and I can't think of the word, but like I'm thinking of like lipstick, but I can't think of the word right now. But it keeps a great color, and that's why I really like this hair. It's free, so you don't have to worry about paying anything. And there are a lot of details. Like, the detail in the braids is beautiful. Like, I've never seen a hair with that's free with this much detail into the braids, other than, like, Sky Sims, who's equally as great. So this next hair is by Casey. It's one of my favorites. I've always used Casey in The Sims 3, and I use her a lot in The Sims 4. She has this one hair. It's like Casey Roulette, and it's beautiful. It has a really detailed braided headband. And again, it's kind of shiny, but it keeps its color and its detail. It has beautiful curls. And it has a lot of gorgeous red colors that I don't see in a lot of hairs. And I really think that's top notch. It happens to be my favorite. And I really just, I use this hair so much now that I found it converted for The Sims 4. So uh, you might see it on one of my Let's Play Sims or a Create a Sim. But definitely check this hair out. So this next hair is one of my first Stelphic hairs that I downloaded, for The Sims 4 at least, and it's really, really beautiful. It has like the twists that pull the hair back from the face, and it really has those long waves. Like I really love long hair, but these waves add texture. It has a lot of great colors, including an ombre color, well, several ombre colors, and a few unnatural colors. and. Like most Stelphic hair, it has like a black hair tip, not tips, what am I thinking of, <laughs> um, roots, and it goes down into like unnatural colors, like I've seen um, blue and green and purple and pink, and like most, I'm sorry, I messed up, I'm sorry, I'm done, but um, it's very, very beautiful. I've used it several times, and it's very good in games. Are you so the last thing I'm going to show you is not a hair at all. It is a hat, and it is cat ears. If you watch my kitty cat, uh, create a sim video, then you've probably seen the cat ears on her. And I really love these cat ears because they're very cute. They come in enough colors that with any color of hair you could use them. Um, 
it blends into the hair for like a natural kind of look. Another thing I really, really like about it is that it has like the furry t kind of texture. And it's really, really gorgeous. Like, it's cute. It's a very beautiful accessory. And I personally will use this a lot. So that concludes this CC custom content, whatever, showcase that I'm going to show you. Sorry, that's like a mower outside. And so this concludes that. I hope you liked it. If you did, like, comic, comic, comic comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Love you.